Welcome back, everyone, to some more Tomb Raider. And oh shit, Snap Son, we are right away caught in a trap. Now, this is something that you have to be aware of uh, while you're playing through the game uh, and through the rest of the game, actually, uh, are these traps. There are going to be traps throughout um, the world, and you just, you know, you, you get better as time goes on about looking out for them. And here we go, we got some new rope gear. I know some of you have been. Uh, telling me in the comment section to get uh, to shoot these things, the, the poles that have ropes on them, shoot them with arrows. I didn't have that yet, so I couldn't do it, but now I can. Um, as you guys can probably hear, Zach is not here right now. Um, he, he had to take care of his brothers. Uh, one of his brothers came home sick from his dad's house and uh, is, is doing kind of bad, so I'd really appreciate if you guys show him some support. In the comment sections, let him know that you guys are thinking about him, and uh, maybe wish his brothers to get better. Um, I sure hope they'll get better. They're strong boys. I know they can do it. Um, I have faith in them. So, but I will be doing a couple videos without him. So, hopefully, you guys can bear through with me. I'm gonna snipe some people here, get them in the head. Although, you know, sometimes you, you gotta be a little bit more careful because. Uh, you don't want to you don't want to expose yourself too much um, now as you saw there were a couple like things see you up here you see oh look a little rope thing that I can pull on um, I know that's kind of what they wanted me to do so I've been trying to do that in this area because I think that's that's their aim they just gave you this new ability they want you to use it but I also like uh, I like sniping with my bow too because I'm bowstastic and that's how it goes um, we took care of them. Got to be a way up. And now we need to find a way up. But how, how do we get up? Um, there's plenty of different areas, plenty of different ways. We're gonna make sure to loot the bodies, because, I mean, salvage is salvage, right? You need to make sure you can upgrade those weapons. Uh, I want to know what you guys also think of the walkthrough so far. Um, if there's anything in particular that you enjoy. My cat just locked himself in this room, so now he's probably going to start meowing at me like crazy to let him out. Yes, he shut the door on himself. He's he's a special kind of cat when it comes to that manner. There you go. Pull that thing over, jump up, and you gotta press X to make sure you latch on. Um, I actually played the game for the first time uh, on the... Uh, on the PC today and it looks good I really enjoy how it looks on the PC it's not simply just a console port or at least that's not how it feels a lot of games you'll get it literally like they took the game from the console and threw it on the PC there's a lot of different customizable options and I think Square Enix and Crystal Dynamics did a very good job of uh, doing that so so we're, we're I think we're, we're gonna come over here maybe looking for another another dude Trying to reunite with our party. Trying just to get everyone back together. Plane didn't do so well. So we're kind of trying to figure out what's going on on this island. Because there's obviously a little bit more than meets the eye. Kind of, you know, it's getting all Transformers on us. That's alright, though. We got this. Um, that looks like a good spot to again. So here's another use for the ability that we just got. Uh, you stand next to make sure you need to be close to one of these poles. You can't just be kind of in the area. You have to be standing pretty much next to it. Shoot it at uh, one of these archways that has the rope on it, and you can, you're can you able to pull yourself across. Now, of course, me being me, uh, I want to make sure that I can get all the salvage possible. So we'll go check out this hut back here, see what's in the hut. Got some arrows, pretty much full of arrows, so it's not, uh, not anything we're concerned with. But I, I know there's something up there, and I want to be able to get up there. I think I might have messed up, because I think I'm going to have to go back. Yeah, that's uh, that seems like probably the best way. And we're going to figure out here if we're able to get um, two ropes on one pole or not. Can't go up that way. We can't go up this way. We've got to go, gotta go up the long way. Can't be lazy about it. This is Tomb Raider, not Couch Raider. Ah, no, we don't get two ropes. We only get one rope, one rope at a time. So, oh well. Oh look, some salvage. <laughs> I knew there was something up here. Is that really all that's up here? Salvage, experience. It wasn't even salvage. It was experience. So those are experience boxes. Ah, 
Gotcha. I understand that. Now, Laura, I want you to jump. There we go. There we go. Here you go, girl. You gotcha, girl. Alright. Another application of this. Shoot the air out that. You pull a little bit harder and you can break open these doors. So if you guys remember back a couple episodes, we ran into one of those and we couldn't do anything with it. Um, it's because I did not have this ability yet. Now we can go back and uh, explore all the different areas. Oh shoot, son. Alright. Got down. Oh, I see some blue smoke. Uh oh, who the fuck's that? Gotta sneak up on him. I'm really glad you moved. <laughs> you and me both, girl. One moment they were fine, the next. There was this storm. It came out of nowhere. It's not your fault, Laura. I called them here, Roth. Hey, we'll find another way. Uh, mayday, mayday. This is co-pilot Jessup of Air Another pilot. One, seven, seven, Hello? Hello? Can you hear me? Yeah, badly hurt when I landed. I need to bring aid. Is anyone there? Captain Jessup, do you read? I've deployed a smoke signal. Please respond. <sighs> Damn it, he can't hear me. I have to get to him. No. The signal's just over there. We've got our own people to worry about. We'll need to regroup as soon as they find Sam. I can't just leave him out there alone. I need to get to him. Sometimes you've got to make sacrifices, Lana. You can't save everyone. I know about sacrifices. No, you know about loss. Sacrifice is a choice you make. Loss is a choice made for you. I can't choose to let him die, Roth. We're not about ready to go sacrificing people and just leaving them to be. We we need to make sure they're okay. Um, but first we need to sit by the fire and warm ourselves up because, uh, you know, we don't do anyone any good if we're all not ready to go about it and all that nonsense. Alright, so we have, uh, we have a couple different skills here. Um, like, I, I need to consult my list of the, the first ten skills that you should get. Um... So, in the Brawler... Is it Brawler? Why well, I, I should have been actually watching this. Um, I believe in the Brawler, you have the ability at once you have seven points to get something in which fitness kills. So, kills such as backstabbing, uh, headshots, or uh, finishers will give you more experience and that I suggest you get as quickly as possible um, simply because the more experience you get the more of these points you get it's kind of like it's like the Fallout 3 thing where you just you get you can get a little extra you can get some extra experience points right away um, oh gosh what is that I think I can't remember what it is but I know I always get it and Raymond always screams at me to make sure I get it um, gotta love Raymond and his obsession with that game. I think he owns it like five or six different times. Um, he hasn't actually played it through on the PC, which is surprising because I played it on 360 and the PC, and the PC was easily my favorite one. This hut looks clear. We ain't gonna find anyone up here. You're probably right, but we got orders. I'm gonna go hide behind here. I'm gonna head down and join the others at the plane. You keep checking these ruins. Yeah, I'll get right on. What was that? Oh shit, they saw me. I wasn't sneaky enough. Dude, god damn it, why weren't you sneaky enough? Okay, that's alright. So why we got pistols and our bow, two headshots, and boom, they're gone. They're taken out. Get some salvage. Oh my god. Rabbits are coming out of their bodies. I'm here, Reyes. What's your situation? We followed a group of men to some kind of city. This place is insane, Roth. What the hell are they God doing? Damn, I don't know. Stay still. I don't think I want to. <laughs> Any <laughs> sign of Sam or Whitman? Nothing yet. Are you with Lara? Yes. We'll be uh, heading down the mountain soon to meet up with you. Okay. We'll try to get in a bit closer. Keep this channel open. Well, that sounded a little fishy. Is Roth, uh, is Roth setting up to betray us here? God damn it, fucking rabbit. Just stop running around. I just want to kill you here. Almost, almost, almost. I probably shouldn't be wasting as much time on rabbits, but, you know, 
He desecrated the body. They just burrowed out from the body like they're alien or something like that. Uh, so I got I gotta kill it. But you know what? I, I probably wasted too many arrows on it. So yeah, we're just gonna walk away unshamefully. <laughs> Used in traditional Japanese herbal medicine or kampo. <laughs> Looks like this vial has been sealed for many years. It's been aging. Some might say it's fermenting. Um, you know, maybe you open up that stuff and you get a little extra kick if you know what I'm talking These about. Are probably maitake mushrooms used to boost the immune system, also known as dancing mushrooms. Hi, Kitty. I don't know if you guys heard him. He wants to get out of the room, but I'm recording right now, Kitty. Come sit by me. Um, by extra kick, I meant sugar rush, obviously. Um, because, I mean, what else would I be talking about that... And it, we're, I don't know where your guys' minds is going with that. Mine was going right to Sugar Rush. That's okay. Ooh, got some salvage from that dude. He's giving it all sorts of salvage. Like Zach said, Rip Sack. He said, uh, I don't even remember what he said. Bones or something. Metal shards in his bones. Um, so the good thing about the statues now, even though I'm probably just going to end up ignoring this one, uh, is we have the instant igniter. Um, so we don't have to go to a fireplace to get that. Shit's blowing up down there, and I don't even know what's going on. Um, it's alright. We'll make it through. I think we will. It's high up in this mountain range. I don't even know what to do. I see. So, okay. I, the one thing that's really good with your survival vision is it will... Um, I knew there was something down here. It was, it's just screaming for something to be down here. Um, but anyways, the survival vision uh, will highlight, will help help you highlight hidden things like the GPS caches and that kind of stuff. How do you even say that? Is it captures, captures? I don't, that's the signal. I, don't I don't quite know how that's said. Yeah, whatever. All right, well, how do we get up there? Maybe we use that little technique we just learned. Yeah, there we go. Stab that arrow. That's... I don't, you know, how does she stab that in? I'm, I'm not quite sure how that is done. Um, maybe it's really soft but sturdy wood somehow? Hmm, whatever. She gets her arrow in there. You know what I mean. Getting the arrow in there, you know, whatever. Rock wall! What you gonna do? You ain't got nothing on me, rock wall. I'll climb all over you all day, oh, any day. We gotta get back. Shit. Careful. Laura, what are you doing? Let me finish. Oh, Oh, well, that was that was unfortunate. Um, hey, dude, no, bad. Rock to the face, haha. <laughs> so I think I hit a little bit of a glitch there. But anyways, I was saying we have the instant lighters with those statues, so you can just light them right up. Just hold X by them. I'm not doing it because I'm better than that. Um, I don't need your your statue sympathy. Oh, I'm just kidding. I'm going. God damn it. Um, all right, Laura. Ooh, what's over here? This looks like a whole different area. What's what's going on over here? Oh my god. Did we just come from there? I think we just came from there. That's okay. Uh, we'll leave this for a different time. I don't know, maybe you can explore more there, but I'm just going to go back through this way. <laughs> the path that we're supposed to be going, because that just seems like the better choice. So, yeah. All right, guys. It's gonna, we're getting towards the end of the episode here. Remember, if you guys have been enjoying these Tomb Raider episodes, remember to leave the like button and let me know in the comments. Also, follow us on Facebook and Twitter, and uh, we'll catch you guys next time. Oh, look, secret tomb location. We've got that up already. Somewhere it must be.